everyone and welcome back to my channel JRC restoration decor and designs and my name is Phyllis in today's video I will be sharing with you how I created a canvas caulk wall art using some drop cloth and just bathroom caulk this is a video of the sectional that I covered for my daughter back in March of this year 2021 and if you'd like to see that video and haven't seen it I will leave it in the description box below but I'm showing this because I used some remnant pieces left over after covering this sectional and the ottoman um, with the drop cloth. And this is what it looked like. I've since hung curtains, wall to wall curtains that she purchased from Amazon in her living room. And it really came out nice. But again, I am going to be covering a canvas that was given to her and the colors. It's a beautiful art piece, but the colors do not go with what she has in her apartment and the canvas art she hung on the opposite side of the wall from the draperies there and behind that drapery is a sliding glass door and coming up is the wall um, this is the wall where the little picture is hanging uh, that is also a DIY but I didn't do a video something really simple but that's where she's going to hang it and this is the canvas art that was given to her again it is very beautiful but there's no colors in her place that matches that and she really didn't care for it herself and this is the piece of drop cloth that I'm using and here I'm going to lay it out and I am going to be using a glue gun to put this all together not a staple gun but a glue gun and here it is um, right now what I'm doing is I'm just taking out the picture hangers you know the the little hoops or the loops that um, the screws go on when you hang it on the wall and here it is I'm just I'm just going to show you here it is in my hand I will not be putting them back on because the wood trimming it sticks out far enough so when she puts the screw in the wall she can just hang it up on the wall and besides the screws were hanging to where the picture would hang um, in a portrait form or landscape form she's going to hang it straight up and down instead of sideways so again i'm going to be covering this using the glue gun and it's gorilla glue sticks i'll be showing you that brand too that i used coming up here um, and then what i do is i fold the canvas over and again this is the glue sticks that i use and i love these glue sticks it's very very strong but i take the canvas and i turn it under just to create a hem and then I glue it onto the canvas board. okay here it is all done and then what's coming up next I'm going to show you that I will be taking a pencil and just freestyling just drawing something um, on top of the canvas I'm drawing just a freestyle art nothing special it's gonna look like leaves I guess and that I'm doing that so I'll have something to trace with the caulk I didn't want to freestyle with the caulk because I didn't want to make a mess and this was my very first time doing this I could envision what I want to do but I'd rather have something to follow so here I don't know if you can see I started drawing you can kind of barely see it where I started drawing something there on with the pencil but here again it's just freestyling and just doing some little curves and connecting lines and that, then I'll create some big leaves I'll be drawing that and then after I draw it I'm going to trace what I drew with the caulk and then later on you'll see down 
in the video where I filled in a few of the large leaves that I drew. So I'll let you continue to watch this. And as I always state in some of my videos, if I need to come back to explain anything, I will do that. So I'm just gonna let you continue to watch to see what I create using the caulk on this canvas. okay here it is all completed again i just filled in a few leaves and i guess you can call those branches i don't know <laughs> but i just filled it in just to kind of give it something different looking and again this is something that just came to my mind and i liked the way it turned out and she did too so um you're going to see the wall again that i showed you in the beginning of the video where she's going to hang it there was a picture frame that had a leaf in it that i had that i hung there on last year for her and she replaced it so um, this again is her living room and this is the wall that picture is going to be replaced with the canvas art that I just drew and I enjoyed it very much and I hope you all enjoyed it too and got some inspiration so I want to thank you all for stopping by Thank you so much for watching JRC Restoration, Decor, and Designs. And remember, the distance between your dreams and reality is called action. So until next time, make it a blessed and productive day, everyone. Bye-bye.